Hey there, you two. This is Randy, the mobile traveler. Anyway. Boo! You suck! There's a gal I know. She is a nomad. She has been broke down for over two months. And all the mechanics around, uh, the paying mechanics, say it's going to cost her anywhere from four to $8,000 to fix her rig. I know that's not true. I know that if I was there, I could get it fixed for a heck of a lot cheaper. That's a lie. There's something wrong with the motor. The motor seized. i tell you how long she's been broke down. Here, back when I was going through Arizona, I told y'all that I stopped to help somebody. It was her. That's how long she's been broke down. The motor was not seized when I was there. But I want to do some, I want to do a crowdfunding. Kick his ass, sea bass! Not to fix her rig, to get me there, where she's at, to fix the rig. Bullet ship! Uh, three years ago, I traveled all the way up to Seattle. Try to help somebody. Y'all remember that. <laughs> that was kind of a fiasco. But, you guys know that's what I do. I try to help people in need. I can't afford it. Honestly, I can't afford to make a trip right now back to Arizona. But with y'all's help, I can. I got to get to Arizona, uh, which you guys know the fuel prices are kind of high right now. And I know that I can get that rig going. You liar! I know that. Uh, that woman can't even get groceries. That's how stuck she is. She's going to rely on other people to do it. Well, sometimes those people are not reliable. Hey, fuck you, man! I... This is the only recourse I have, is y'all. You guys have helped me in the past, and I'm hoping you'll help me help her. Help me help you. So... Let's help a fellow human out. I can't diagnose things over the phone. I think I got it figured out, truthfully. But I got to be there because nobody will listen to me. Fuck you. Fuck you. So. The next day. I'm going to check his oil level. I got a jump pack sitting on the battery because the battery's dead. And she told me that the oil level was over full. Oh, see, that's not pretty. Oh, shit. Right there, that tells me that... Uh, uh, cracked block, head gasket, something because there's no oil down here. That is fluid. That is water. That is water. So, okay. Ain't nobody got time for that. Well, since we checked the oil, there's no, but there's water in it. I'm gonna crack this nut loose. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's just water coming out, not even oil. Now we're getting oil. Are you? Yeah, now I'm getting oil. Okay, stop it. You see how full that is? So, yeah, we gotta get rid of it. No, <laughs> it's <laughs> Officials in Speedway now are looking for the person who is dumping oil into the wastewater system there. They say this large amount of industrial oil is really putting a burden on the water treatment system and it's costing them a lot more money. The suspect could face criminal charges and be charged with paying the cleanup costs. I'm afraid it might be beyond my scope of uh, backwoods mechanics. You dick! The next day. Hey, 
Hey everybody, this is Randy the Mobile Traveler. Hope this video finds you well. I am sitting here just outside Williams, Arizona. And I came up here. Well, long and the short of it, I failed. So let's talk about the fail. I came up here to try to fix her rig. Bullshit. I can't do it. Loser! You're a loser! Her family started to GoFundMe. And I am going to put that link to the GoFundMe in my video in the, des in the description. Um, that's the only way I can help her right now. I I've done everything else I could do.